What's good, what's good? Welcome back to Invest and Trade with Jax. Happy Tuesday. Good early afternoon from Canada. We're going to go over our friend Ethereum, currently sitting at 1597, uh, down 1% on the day, sitting a market cap of 192B, 24 hour volume, 18.79 billion. Ladies and gentlemen, if you're new to Bicket, make sure to sign up, grab up to 8K in bonuses. No VPN required from our US traders. Email me your sign-up email after you make your first deposit. I'll give you free access to my Discord of over 2,000 members. Let's hop into the charts. So it looks like our wave four is playing out. Um, we haven't seen too much movement here, just consolidation. Um, the, the Fed meeting tomorrow, the interest rate hike will be released. And I do think we will see volatility. If we sell off today before... Um, if we sell off today before the announcement going into tomorrow and we trend back towards oversold, then we could have an opportunity to bounce to the upside. However, if we just consolidate here and we have this bearish divergence upon tomorrow's announcement release, we could see a dump. 75 basis points is expected. Um, so it can be already priced into the market here. Uh, but as we did right here, where's the price of Bitcoin? Let me get a chart of Bitcoin. So right here, we had a FOMC announcement and we were pushing up into the announcement. They released the news and we dumped. So we have seen a nice push up over the last few days, over the last uh, week or so. So if we just consolidate here and we don't sell off before the announcement, then that could lead to a dump. So just be aware of that here. Um, which would be totally fine. We still have room to come down on this four hour bearish divergence and this wave four pullback in between 1447 and 1560. So if we do come lower, that's perfectly healthy for the chart as long as we don't break the 0.5. If we break the 0.5 and invalidate, it invalidates that as a wave four. And uh, potentially we'd have to be looking at some sort of reversal in the trend. Now looking on the daily time frame, we talked about the bullish cross, which has printed for the price of Ethereum. Uh, so it would be healthy to see a little bit of pullback come back into the EMAs. They catch up to the candles and we see continuation to the upside. I do think that's a likely scenario, especially if we consolidate into tomorrow. The announcement could trigger sell off to bring us back down to the daily EMAs and then see continuation to the upside. In my opinion, the really bearish wave count is still at play here. Um, that this was a wave one down. All of this is a wave two pullback looking to come down to wave three. It's starting to look less and less likely, in my opinion. But until we start to break above this previous high at 1773, it is still on the table, but not that probable, in my opinion. I think it's more likely we see some pullback to the EMAs and then see continuation to the upside. I do think we will see a little bit more sell off. But if we were to break out from here, then we can push up in a wave five as we have this nice bull flag forming. So if we did break out from here, measure flag pull, take it to your point of breakout. And it will take you all the way up to your wave five target about 1787 you can take a trend base of extension from the bottom of wave two to the top of wave three to the bottom of wave four if this were to be the bottom here 618 extension is coming in at 1840 i do think ethereum has a little bit more room to come down so if we bounce off the point 382 for the wave four then you would push up to 1779 uh, which also lines up with the bull flag target if we were to just continue to consolidate in this channel all the way down to the 0.382 and then you can see a nice push up to about 1779 that's it for this one make sure to sign up to bitget make your first deposit email me your sign up email free access to my discord of over 2000 members posting chart patterns talking all things crypto and at the ten dollar membership early access to my analysis as well as my trade signals sign up to the patreon link and i'll see you in the next video all right much love take care